Here we are at Curtis. Zero feet altitude, one feet distance, three miles per hour. Might be surprised to hear me say I'm going to fly a mission. Get me a vocal point for a my focus. It's a little technicality. Let's do this. Two hundred seventy five feet altitude, one hundred thirteen feet distance, three miles per hour. There he goes. There's a little bit of a breeze up there right now, but it's not too bad. And I don't believe I lose any connection on this one, so we should be all right. It's not going to go that far. It's going to go in a, up and down the roads here. It's not a long mission. Just have to watch it when it's on the way back. Because it seems like pretty good tailwind right here. Almost sunset, seven o'clock. Figured I'd get one flight in. Two hundred seventy-four feet altitude, two thousand thirty-eight feet distance, twenty-five miles per hour, ninety percent battery. They got them big trailers. They look like the ones they use to move uh, the wind turbines. That looks like smoke out there. Bonfire. Two hundred seventy four feet altitude, three thousand nine hundred eighty feet distance, twenty three miles per hour, eighty six percent battery. Big bonfire. My picture's a little sketchy right here. But it's at the furthest point out. They got a good signal. I'd be a little concerned coming back here. See how fast or slow it goes when it turns. The wind seemed to die let up a little bit. It never seems that breezy when I leave my house. I don't like this camera. I get really bad blur in the upper left hand corner. Picture looks like shit. It's the camera itself. I mean, I just cleaned it. And I, I can't see it that good on the screen here, but when I'm watching it on the, on the big screen, you can definitely see it. It's almost, it's almost like having a piece of cook in your eye. I can, I can see right here that the, the horse stable there is out of focus. 
But it's just that one part of the camera. I got to get a new camera. Luckily, they're cheap. They're only about 20 bucks. They're all poles. They're plentiful. I got good speed. It's going to go up around the neighborhood by the golf course now. I'll just let it go because it's not going that far. It's going to climb to 300 feet. I can see, like, everything on the right is in perfect focus, but on the left, blurry. There's no scratches in the lens or anything, it's just a shit camera. It's an easy fix. This gets to be an expensive hobby, I'll tell you that. If you're not shooting yourself in the foot and make a mis making a mistake, it's always something else out of your control. Like, I had all kinds of trouble with uh, my regular drone there, Joni McJone face, whatever I call it. That's the one I usually use. And uh, the picture started just out of the blue for no reason, and it never crashed. The picture started getting jumpy. So I go to change a new, um, you know, just put a new gimbal cable on it. Three, four times after, it doesn't work, it doesn't work. I get a picture, I don't get a picture. Forward sensor's not working. All this bullshit. Just to change the goddamn camera. And it's just, it's, the real problem is it's just shit design. The camera's terrible. They, I, I guess they figured it out on the, on the Pro 2, but I don't want to get one of them yet. I don't need to have the latest, greatest. Yeah, I'm just flying a drone. I'm sorry? I'm flying my oh, drone. Okay, I work here. I just oh, do you? Sure, uh, yeah. I come out here at night, it's a great spot, see? Oh, no shit. That, that is shit, cool. Yeah. yeah. Okay, just wanted to check. Yeah, I'm fine. Night. I hope you guys don't mind. I come no, down. Not at all. All right, Thank cool. You. Thanks for stopping and checking. One of the guys that work here just check it in, make sure I was all right. Appreciate that. Now I'm going slow.
299 feet altitude, 3,996 feet distance, 8 miles per hour, 53% battery. Should pick up speed here. I still have a good battery. I'm not that far away. It's over the golf course. It's slow, but I'm in good shape. It should be doing 20. That's all right. I'm in my comfort zone. Yeah, I was saying, uh, yeah, I'm not, a, not ready to buy a, a Mavic Pro 2 yet. Your prices are still too high. When they start to come down, I don't need to have the latest, greatest. I don't care about that. Feet altitude, 3,828 feet distance, 7 miles per hour, 43% battery. should pick up speed when it gets over back to the highway 300 feet altitude 3675 feet distance 8 miles per hour 37% battery See, the picture looks blurry in certain spots, but I can't tell if that's the reception. Or it's out of focus. And you can't really reset the focus when you're moving. Six hundred seventy two feet distance, five miles per hour, thirty two per cent battery. How far away am I? I'm going to bring it back. Mission ended. Just to be safe. fly it by hand I probably would have been fine except it was going to go a little further on that turn 
300 feet altitude, 2,400 And it was only doing distance, five. 22 miles per hour, 28% battery. You know, I'm almost out of gas. I don't know, that picture looks fucking blurry. Hope it wasn't blurry the whole time. Ruins your flight. Warning, aircraft battery at 25%. Two hundred nine feet altitude, nine hundred fifty five feet distance, twenty miles per hour, twenty four percent battery. Warning, aircraft battery at twenty three percent. There he is. Pretty good flight time. Warning, aircraft battery at 19%. Let it fly over to the road and come back. A lot of hang time there, 18 minutes, 47 seconds. I'm hoping the whole flight wasn't blurry because it looked like it was blurry. So, that happens if it was dark when I tried to get my focal point. Um, so, I may have been, uh, it may not have focused right. So anyways, live and learn happens. Shit happens. Anyways, otherwise a decent flight, you dove out.